are we all doing today? Up everybody's well. We're cooking with you. We've not done one for ages. So uh, we're going to make, as you just saw there, some battered jumbo sausages. They are from Ravi Ramsdoms. Ravi Ramsdom. 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 That guy, yeah, that fella. And we'll see what these look like in the box and then get them cooking. Don't need to have chips and potatoes with them. What shall I have, everybody? Shall I have some potatoes? Yeah, we're going to have some mashing sausage. Maybe some peas. On the box, it does show chips and mushy peas and some, well, battered sausage, obviously. I don't know if I've got any mushy peas, actually. Have I got any in the cupboard? I don't know. Sure, I've got some some way. Let me just check. I've got marrow fat peas, marrow fat peas, marrow fat peas, and marrow fat peas. Can't find any mushy ones. Oh dear, well, I'll just have to have a sausage and mash. Okay, okay, let's open it and have a look what it looks like inside. It'll look like a battered sausage, presumably. <laughs> okay. Let's see how big they are. Are they real jumbo? Are they the same size as you to get in a chip shop? Possibly. Yeah. Maybe a little bit longer in a chip shop. So, we are going to put that in the air fryer. And it's going to take 15 minutes. First thing to do is get the mash on. Oh, get the mash on. That's what we need to do. Let's just get these potatoes done. Thrown into a pan. And then we'll cook our sausage. Our battered sausage. I can't wait to taste this. It's going to be absolutely delicious. And I can't remember how much they were. I'm going to scooby do. So what I'll do is check on that for you and then get it on the bottom of the screen. Okie dokie. It does say new recipe as well. So these must have been out before. Now it's got a new recipe on it. So we shall see. When it's done, it is a small potato, isn't it? Look at that baby potato there. <laughs> okay. And then they've got a big one to cut up as well. So I'm going to get the mash on first, get a sausage in, and see what it tastes like. Some people might want to eat one sausage. Some people might want to eat two sausage. These sausages, so I'll just do like one so you can see me better. There you go. See me better now, can't you? Yeah. So these sausages go in at 180 degrees Celsius into the air fryer. And they cook for 15 minutes. Now, I might have said that they came from... Tesco, I think I did it at the start of the video. It's from Iceland. If I didn't say Tesco, it's Iceland. I've not looked back, so... So, yeah. So, uh, they are from Iceland. Hopefully, I'll put the price on the bottom. I don't know what they're going to taste like, but we'll stick them to the air fryer. Cook it for 15 minutes, and then see what it tastes like at the end. We'll give it a little taste test. Okay, 180. For 15 minutes. Where's the 15? Crikey. There we go. Potatoes cooking nice as well. I'm going to have some mash. And I may have some peas as well. I'm have some peas. Put some down there. Let's go British marrow fat peas. I wish I had some mushy ones. I don't think I have. I'll search this cupboard high and low and see if I can find some. I don't know what I can find any, but look what I've just found in the cupboard. I forgot I had this. Christmas pudding. <laughs> I hope I do that one day. It has got May 2025 on it. Completely forgot that one, eh? So, yeah, look out for a Christmas pudding video coming out in July. <laughs> we might actually do that, yeah, just to see what it tastes like. A bit fresh, won't it? Three months matured. So, it's, this is three months matured. I got this in December. That means it's now three months. December, three months. So it's 10 months rich short now, so <laughs> we shall see. Now then, there's been a kitchen disaster. Oh my goodness, I've just burnt the potatoes. Yeah, I've let the water bowl dry by accident and they've just boiled, so I'm going to throw some chips in instead. At least going to take about 15 minutes, so I'm going to take the sausage out and throw these chips in instead because I've just had a right disaster. But nobody's perfect, I'll have to take the sausage out first of all because that's cooked. Because this is definitely cooked. Right, I'll show you that in a minute. Right, I'll just uh, throw some chips in for 15 minutes. These are delicious as well. These cost a pound. 
Eis und das ist noch ein bisschen dann uh, you can always sort something out if something goes wrong right these go more night as well for 15 minutes what I'll do is throw the sausage back in after about 10 minutes and then I think it take about 20 minutes actually 15 to 20 minutes so that's cooking then I'll put a sausage back in but it's cooked yeah it's cooked so so it stays warm about five minutes before then I'll just throw it back in because if it stays so it doesn't look cold does it I'm just wondering about food poisoning I don't think you'll get food poisoning from it so don't quote me on that okay so I think sausage and chips instead with these lovely chips from Iceland they've saved the day Hey, so after my cooking this after, never mind, let's take the sausage out, there we go, I'm going to cut that in a minute and take a look at what it looks like inside. And take the chips out as well. The chippy runes, they're not potato runes because the potato runes got burnt. And let's get the chippy runes out. I was using my lifter, but I won't use my lifter. Not lifter, what? Uh, <laughs> fish. What do, what do you call it? A fish slice? Whatever you want to call it. Right, so we're going after that. We should have had some peas, I don't know. I would have had beans with that, but I've not got any beans, so forget that. This is going well, isn't it? Right, but the main thing is I want to show you this sausage. So let's turn it round. This jumbo sausage. And see what it looks like inside. I'll just get a knife. And cut it. It looks quite nice already, doesn't it? It looks quite good. Plenty of batter on it. Definitely plenty of batter. Let's taste the batter. Mmm. Taste the sausage. So it's a little bit smoked, a little bit smoky. Yeah, it's quite nice, that. Yeah, definitely. Get some salt and vinegar on it. Maybe a bit of ketchup as well, if you like ketchup on them. And then George. Well, if you've enjoyed the video, the uh, thing just pinged them because I didn't quite turn on. Them chips take about 15 minutes. About 180, and we've worked out pretty well yet after about 15 minutes. So, I would highly recommend that. Definitely, that sausage is delicious. Them chips look delicious. Always put your vinegar on first because if you put your salt on first, your vinegar washes the salt away. So, get your vinegar on like that, get a bit of salt on, and go and tuck in and enjoy your nosh. I would highly recommend them sausages, yeah, if you like a bit of smoky sausage, because that's got a bit of smoke in it as well. So, uh, yeah, recommend them, which was, of course, Harry Ramston's sausages. Harry Ramston's, and you get four of them, it's Harry Ramston's sausages, absolutely delicious. Well, I'll be back with another video very shortly. I don't know if it'll be a cooking one. I know we're going to Wales this coming weekend. So we're going to be having loads of Welsh videos. No, they're not going to be in Welsh. They're going to be in English. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so we are going to Wales. So we'll be doing quite a few videos, vlogs and things around Wales. So look out for them. We might get another cooking video before then. But look out because remember fun times are always good times. I'll see you again next time. Till next time, for me. Ciao for now, see you soon!